Recording Fred Tad is short, also known as the Hulk. How you doing? <laughs> it's me. What the heck? <laughs> Hulk smash. <laughs> Fred, uh, I think you first did uh, you first did uh, the Hulk, probably like eight years ago. About eight years ago. What is, did you ever imagine you'd be starring in your very own like Hulk TV show? I and did. coming to D23. I would never, honestly, it's a dream. It is actually not to sound schmaltzy. It's a dream come true. I would have never expected uh, this to happen. I'm so thrilled. Two shows, even. I mean, to have. Avengers and then Hulk and the Agents of Smash. I would have never dreamed it. Now, I mean, we all love Earth's Mightiest Heroes. I think the new show is really good. I think you're the only guy who came over from the Earth's Mightiest Heroes cast, and you have to audition for all these things separately. So, do you ever get worried, about, man? Maybe I won't get to play the whole. Well, game. it happens. You know, you never know. You really never know. Each project is a new incarnation. I've known so many different uh, Thors, and we've all played Bing. We've all, you know, you play different characters over the years right. and uh, I'm, I am very grateful that I was able to stay on. What is what is so cool about getting to do this sort of Hulk family show? It's almost it's well, almost kind of like like a Hulk sitcom. Almost. It is a Hulk sitcom and like a reality show. Yeah. Well, keeping and, and, up with the Hulks. Yeah. Well, and that's how it's shot too. I love the split screen. We get to stop time right. and have we'd be in the middle of an action and then go to a confessional and say I'm really I was really scared and then go right back into the scene. That's a lot of fun. What's great is working with that cast. Um, and the Hulks are not all the same kind of Hulk. They are so diff radically different from one another. And they even look different. They look totally different. They have different skills, different mindsets. So it's really like, it is like having a family with a, with a devil dinosaur. I, I saw, we saw the devil dinosaur episode yeah. at Comic-Con. Um, I'm just curious, do you see this, is this Hulk in Ultimate Spider-Man and Avengers Assemble and Hulk Agents of Smash, is this the same, do you think this is the same Hulk or do you think they're all separate? No, they're they're the same Hulk at heart, okay. but they are Hulk at a different level in his evolution. Right. You know, I like to say, when I first started, he was Savage Hulk in the Hulk vs. series, right. he was a monster, and then when he went to the first Avengers show, it was a re he wanted to be left alone and he was a reluctant hero. And then by the time we go to the Avengers Assemble, he actually likes being part of the team. And uh, hey, um, he likes being part of the team. Uh, and he, uh, and then in Spider-Man, it's more of a buddy. He, he and Spidey are more like it's a buddy film. And you see the goofier side of Hulk. By the time we get to Avengers, I'm sorry, Hulk and the Agents of Smash, he's in a leadership role and actually wants to be proactive, saving the world helping people who are Hulks right. and showing the world that he's not a monster. Now, w what about Banner? Are we ever going to see Bruce Banner again? Or is he I, I with certainly, the personality? I or certainly hope so, because okay. I, I love playing Banner. Because to me, Hulk is Banner. Right. You know, I have to start with Banner, and that's the guy I connect right. with. And thank God, you know, Banner's a good guy, because that makes Hulk a good guy. Right, exactly. Uh, and Hulk really is just peaceful. He wants to be peaceful, rather. He, that's his big art. The thing is, I think the way they're gonna they're honoring the comic books and that he's gonna be more fused with Banner and be Hulk. Like he has Banner's kind of his intellect. Right? Yeah, but he's exactly. But I think it's the, these characters as Hulks find it more. It's just easier to be the Hulk all right. the time. They want to show the world that this is who they really are and not hide from it. Right. I think, I would love to see you play Banner sometime because you've never actually voiced Banner. I do a little in this, in, in, oh, uh, in okay. Avengers Assemble. Oh, okay. No, but uh, yeah, okay. but very little. No, I would love to. I would. It would be an honor. Just because I thought you did a great Beast in two shows and Thank the X Men anime too, and Wolverine and X Men. So I think love you, playing Beast. You, and uh, you know, you play a great scientist and a great butler. So Thank I think you, I, you, you know, I really a appreciate great Jarvis. That. So, Thank you. So, um, okay. So, uh, what is your favorite line as Hulk? Can you say it for us? <laughs> well, I, there's always Hulk smash and puny god. Uh, uh, leave Hulk alone. It's another one. I like lately though. We've been playing Hulk, being uncomfortable with all the, um, with all the crowds and you know all the cameras. And it's like just that kind of yeah. Why don't you just leave me alone? Oh, the Pavarotti. <laughs> you know? Yeah.
So, you know, there's a lot of lines, but I just love the new, the new, the Hulk being just kind of like, well, all right, let's just tone it back a little. Uh, Fred, congratulations on hey. all your success. Looking forward to seeing lots of Hulk smack in the coming months. Thank you so much. Thank you, Fred. A real pleasure, always. Love you, Fred. Yeah. You're the best.